Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. Today, we're delving into a pressing issue in Wales, the junior doctor strike and its impact on the NHS. Let's get right into it. The strike, starting on Monday, stems from a pay dispute between the British Medical Association, EMA, and the Welsh government. Despite Health Minister Elinid Morgan's acknowledgement of the doctor's frustration, she asserts that no additional funds are available without cutting from other NHS areas. With nearly 4,000 junior doctors in Wales, the strike poses a significant challenge. NHS leaders, like Darren Hughes of the Welsh NHS Confederation, express concern about the strike coinciding with one of the most pressured weeks of the year, especially following intense winter pressures. A staggering 98% of the 65% of junior doctors who voted have backed the walkout. Doctors Oba Babs Osibaju and Peter Fahey, co-chairs of BMA Cymru Wales Junior Doctors Committee, stress that this difficult decision was driven by a 15-year pay drop and a feeling of being undervalued. The strike's impact is considerable. One health board postponed 80% of planned operations and 75% of outpatient appointments. While Welsh doctors received a 5% rise, their counterparts in England and Scotland got 8.8% and 12.4%, respectively. For patients, it's crucial to attend planned appointments unless otherwise informed. The strike primarily affects hospitals, but some GP surgeries may also be impacted. For health advice, the NHS 111 Wales website is the recommended first point of contact. This strike highlights the ongoing challenges within the NHS and the critical role of junior doctors. We'll keep you updated as the situation unfolds. For more news and insights, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Stay informed, stay healthy. See you in the next video.